Hey guys, how are we doing? Had a major heart attack. Memory card would not work. I was just like, what's going on? But anyway, <laughs> oh my god. I wasn't even expecting it to see the... I wasn't expecting to see the records. <laughs> that was terrible. Right, okay, anyway. Uh, we are back on Fate's Day Night Unlimited Blade Works Abridged. Episode 1, The Bay Cometh. Now, I didn't realise so many of you would be like, whoa, <laughs> you know, in the comments section of that first one. And I've taken everything in. I just really want to enjoy this abridged um, show. I mean, there's only three episodes. What I think will, uh, what I'll do is, <clears throat> I'll watch these three, and then I'll just keep watching Fate Stay Unlimited Blade Works. So I've only watched the first like four or five episodes of Fate Stay Night Unlimited Blade Works. I'm really, really enjoying it. So I want to watch this, um, and then I'm just trying to get into a lot of different anime shows. I'm going to stick with it, finish it, and then I'm going to watch Fate Stay Night at some point, like you guys suggested, and then there's Fate Stay Zero or something like that. Um, until then, I'm just going to keep. Uh, I'm going to watch these because. I just love Blazing Azuri Crow. The comedy comedy is great, and the way they put these together is absolutely fantastic. I'm hoping they're going to do like um, with the Bleach S, start like mixing in other episodes. So obviously that first one was like 48 minutes long, and they made it into eight, 18 minutes. So like, that was fantastic. But um, anyway, <coughs> let's get into this. Face Day Night on Blade Blayworks Epbridge Episode One: The Bay Cometh. The following is a fan-based parody. Fate Stay Night Unlimited Blade Works belongs to the people on the screen. Please support the official release. No problemo, amigo. And someone said there's no English dub. There isn't on Netflix. <laughs> For me, anyway, in the UK version. God's sake, Shiro. You're going to catch a cold out here, and I'll have to take care of you, and make you soup, and Such. clean your stupid blanket. <laughs> hey! ground and come inside hi sakura did i fall asleep fixing literally everything i could get my hands on again sudden thought Shiro. what if you didn't pick up trash around the neighborhood and didn't try to fix said trash yeah pipes are so useful literally everything has a pipe somewhere probably <laughs> oh shiro you silly idiot we have too many pipes stop fixing pipes or else? Listen, Sakura, I'm not gonna fight you on this. I just know deep in my heart that we do now and always will need more pipes. As the sole provider of pipes in this household, I understand this better than anyone. I'll be inside making food for you and Taiga. Don't put yourself out thanking me once in a while. <sighs> what would we do without her? Too bad she can never know why I fix all this stuff. On that note, back to work, Shiro. <laughs> Today you yeah. save pipes, tomorrow, the world. Yeah. <laughs> cool. <laughs> it's all not a live voice, it's just like I can't, can't get away from it. <clears throat> Watch it, impossible! <laughs> Fixed in and limited blade bridge. Sweet. Then Shinji took the broken part of the bench and started using it to block arrows, but since he couldn't get to Ayako without getting his face impaled, he threw the closest thing at her. That's how the heater got involved. Truly, it was the real victim here. Yes, it didn't ask for this. Give it to me straight, this Shiro. Can it be world. saved? Oh yeah, totally. Go. Just need some tape and soldering. And sweet, delicate love. Your methods are strange, Emiya. But they've never failed us yet. However, I don't know why you won't let me watch when you fix the electronics. Hey, dude. A man's gotta have space to perform his craft. But seriously, if you want this thing fixed, you need to get out. Right, right. Gotta <laughs> perform your magic, as it were. Right. Something like that. <laughs> Something Here, like that. Quite, reveal your secrets to me. Quite literally. <laughs> perform your magic. No, no, no. That's just neat tape. Radical. Truly, I do the work of heroes. Oh, well, if it isn't Little Miss School Princess, come to bewitch more young minds with your feminine wiles. Algebra, actually. I'm not going to be in class tomorrow and thought I should get my work before I head out. Algebra, well, actually. I'll have you know your hedonistic tricks won't work on me, you vulgar hussy. Excuse me? Oh, is that well, real? <laughs> Maybe I you should, should go say hi to, to her. Oh, the tagger, have you considered that you're super boring and she might hate you for it? <laughs> Good call, Brain. I forgot how social we inept I am. Cheryl, could you come over here for a second? No, I'm scared of talking to Rin on account of her being awesome and me being Shiro Emia. She's still here, Shiro. I think she heard that. Hi, Rin. You're really cute and you scare me also. I get that. I 
<laughs> Greetings, Shiro Emiya. Oh, this dickhead. Honestly, I was starting to worry <sighs> that you would never show up to class. And I couldn't imagine a day without my best friend. I just slept in because I was fixing pipes. Yes, you do. How dare you speak to me in that way? I will return yes. once I decide on a yes. punishment befitting your intolerance. Yes. That's Did I miss something? something? Shinji and I have a unique friendship. I think. Oh, it was brilliant. Because he's such a twat. <laughs> Hi. Nice night tonight. It would be a terrible night to die. Huh? I don't disagree with that, <laughs> but context, please? Context, please. Hello? That's great. Tiny frightening child. <laughs> Tiny frightening child. Try to think this of the family, awesome. Shiro. The if something happened to you, I wouldn't be able to come the here and amazing. eat Sakura's cooking. Is that what you want? I probably would have dropped kicked her off the road, but letting it go. Too. We're not really family, Taiga, and I'm not drop kicking a little girl, Sakura. Little girls can have big knives. Just saying. <laughs> I would have won Kung Fu on her. Would have been awesome. That's Plus, so I was close enough to home. I could have come here and grabbed one of my many pipes. I'd love that bravado, Shiro. When I was your age, I was so ready to kick ass. I got disqualified from an international kendo tournament for being too amazing at owning bitches. That's a thing that happened. There's no lie here. Your dream of becoming a hero is pretty cool too, I guess. Just sort of vague. I don't know what you mean. I think it's pretty specific. Get ripped, save everyone. Sounds like a stellar dream to me. Sounds kind of stupid. Sorry, not sorry. Well, hold sorry, on. Nobody gets to say my dream is stupid except me. Sorry, not sorry. Man, Damn. those guys. They don't mean to be close-minded. They'd believe in my dream if they knew I had magic powers. True. Isn't that right, Pipe? They just don't know. They just don't know. I do love how he uses the pipe to fight against um, Lancer. Ah, it's awesome. So what if I fail at saving pipes? People are the important thing. One day, I'm gonna become the biggest damn hero they've ever seen, and then they'll see. Except they won't, cause magic. Oh. Do, 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 do. Sakura. Yes, Lord of Loud. Your hand. Oh, Lord of Loud. Oh, you're so my bruise. What horrific villain hurts you? Really not that big of a deal. Probably more my business. Reparations will be paid in blood. Please don't. Shinji. Zero. You hit Sakura. You know it. That's bad, Shinji. What the hell is wrong with you? For a second, Emmy, I thought we were having a moment. No, I didn't hit Sakura. Good. I just smacked her a bunch and she bruised. What the hell kind of distinction did you just make? Do you want to do me a favor and clean the dojo? Yes! Then I'm going to come back and obliterate you! Whatever floats your boat. What I a got here! <laughs> what a dick. And that's why he was there. <laughs> now to find Shinji and murder him dead. Huh? What the heck is going on? Those guys have super cool clothes and weapons. Yeah. I want that! Who's there? <laughs> Who just complimented us? I'm sorry! <laughs> they're so cool, they're so cool, they're so cool! I want to be just like those guys! How about you ever see them again? Too slow. Who just complimented me? Yeah, don't kill me, I'm a hero! No. <laughs> don't kill me, I'm a hero. Did he leave? <laughs> Did he spare me? Who was he? Of course not. Turn around. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> no witnesses. He seemed like he thought I was cool. Oh. I ripped up his heart. He wasn't too smart. My masters made me play the fool. Sorry, kid. No witnesses. Mage oh. rules. Mage rules. wouldn't want to be a hero anyways. We all meet tragic bullshit endings because the human condition reacts more viscerally to negative environmental changes. No one likes the heroes who got off scot-free. Just ask my buddy Fergus. A blind spearman got him while swimming. Sucks to be Fergus. Sucks to be you. So this is it, huh? A lifetime of rescuing lost pipes and this is the end I meet. Wow. Are you serious? You're that annoying hijab kid that's never being a hero, never saving anyone. Dad was right. Being a hero is. No, I can't let you die, or else I have to feel bad. What is this?
is that thing? It's so beautiful. And he's alive. Okay, I'll turn to Vets. Uh, whatever, I'm okay. Suck it, Fergus. Whoever you are. Home sweet home. Yeah, I'd be like that. This I'd is fall fine. over. The just, floor is fine. just. Those guys in blue and red were awesome. Even if that bastard tried to kill me, I was the most excited I've ever been. That red guy's swords looked a bit awkward, though. Those guys must have been mages, right? I wonder if my dad ever saw mages like that. Oh, oh you're a mage! Huh? Get dead! Ah, Lance is back. What are you doing? Oh, see, is, I love this, yeah. I originally killed you because normies can't see mage shenanigans. It was part of your kind's code that I eliminate you. Alright, I accept that, but I'm a mage! That you are. Got that now. So... Go away? Can't do that. <laughs> Why not? Let's just call it professional pride. Trace on. May so, I ask what you're doing? Go away. This poster may not be a pipe, but with a little bit of reinforcement magic, it can be like. I forgot it was a poster, I'm not a pipe. Smack you in the face with my pipe, blue bomber. Right. Here's the thing about that. <laughs> yeah, time to find the red guy. <laughs> Oh. When you say red guy, <laughs> love it. You weren't talking about that saber, were you? He didn't seem to be in much of a rush to save you the it's first not a time. <laughs> oh no, he's going into a shed. What am I gonna do? Uh, Maybe I can throw my really? rocks at him. Heads up! Damn it! <laughs> I'm sorry, kid. We do see a saber zoom. this at all, on the record. There once was a lancer in blue. He had a dark job to do. His prey was so sad, but it wasn't that bad. In his next knife, he might get a clue. You know what, Lancer? I've got a whole can of not your business with your name on it. Like, the can is my business, but not what's inside the can. That is a weird metaphor. <laughs> when I was young... The previous version of me died in an accident. I was saved by the most valiant act of heroism I could ever comprehend. I'm never letting that feeling go. I'm never letting it die. Even if my body dies, the image in my mind of that hero will live on. And as long as I'm here, I'll be the vessel that becomes that image and save everyone in front of me. At your behest, You've got to be kidding me! <laughs> Thou art my master who has summoned me from beyond the withered grasp of time. Cool. Born as is the new moon to engage and slay at your grim command. What? I'm just doing a bit. I can speak modern English just fine. <laughs> are you my master? <laughs> yes. And is that Lancer? Yes. I'm gonna kill him. What? You're not going to get this, but I just finished working through some really heavy nonsense with another guy. I'm going to take it out on Lancer. BRB. Huh. Modern lingo. Neat. Whoa. Cool. I can't help but be upset that I was seconds away from preventing a servant from being summoned. Hmm? He... <laughs> your skill with the spear is astounding. It's a pity your so cool that not as keen her whole thing is that like the sword can't be seen. Oh shit, that old school desktop. <laughs> Where are you looking? It must be difficult though. Right, Fighting with the sword you can't even see. What servant are you? What is that weapon? Confused? Perhaps I've been beating you with my faithful bow, Lancer. Oh, sure, Robin Hood. Where's the merry men? My classification eludes you, but it sucks to be you. I've figured out your identity. First name Mario. Last name Mario. Kukulain, Ireland's child of light and faithful dog. Can I level with you for a moment? You're the second person tonight to pull that out of nowhere. Do I have it written on my back or what? Your prowess with a spear speaks for itself, Lancer. You're pretty tight. Tight. 
Would never have thought to use that word that way. You're acclimating to all the modern slang that the Grail taught us. Faux shizzle. It takes a while. Don't worry, though. You won't have enough time to worry about getting it right. I want that! Prepare yourself, fun. woman. You're about to face my most unavoidable blow. Steal yourself! Wow. Game ball. And then... And then it goes back and does that weird thing. Your attack was strong, but your aim was. Uh. Behold! The fangs of Kalein's dog! Okay. Not to be a sore loser or anything. But did that attack just miss? That attack rewrites causality! My instincts and my luck. Those skills together saved me. Well, that's dumb. My attack that will always pierce the heart was disrupted by a metaphysical critical role on a d20. In that case, my master instructed me to return home if my gay bulb were to ever be used. You're running? Yeah, my master's just a bit concerned with the prospect of me fighting people who can survive fate-altering attacks. That said, I'm pretty confident I could kill you. Feel free to chase me and find out. Round, he's Hi, away. my name is Chiro Emia, and I've got- Emia?! Sorry, go on. Got some questions. I'd be happy to answer them. I, however, am still seething from a decade-old grudge, and there's another servant. What? You stay here. No guns or explosives, please. I don't have those things. You never know. I'm going to go kill the master before I develop any attachment to them, and someone chops off their hand or shoots them in a wheelchair. You're gonna kill someone? Wrong place, wrong time! Saber, wait! Shit, shit, shit! <laughs> Saber, Saber, wait, let's talk about this. Win? Saber! Stop! Um, okay. There's no way to this, but right now I'm not super cool with command seals. In future, please run all command seal based requests past me or else! Rin, we are seriously 5,000% dead. We need to run. Chill, actually, Satan. <laughs> I've got an idea. <laughs> Is it run? Because I'm all about run right now. Hello, Shiro Emiya. How's that social ineptitude working out for you? Oh, please don't. I love your friend, Shiro. You know, Rin, you and I may have more in common than I initially thought. I want your servant! Give me data! Well, there's my expectations flying right out the window. Don't make me end you, Shiro. Brilliant. Thanks for watching. Feel free to subscribe if you'd like to keep up with the channel and see more in the future. If you'd like to support us in creating more and see previews before episodes come out, feel free to head over to our Patreon. Of course, there are things in the world that should be aborted before they come into being. Perhaps this series is one of them. That was really good, I like it. <coughs> like it lots. Yeah, it was really good. It's class. <coughs> Excuse me. There were a couple of scenes I didn't recognise, though. So, this is where the comment section is going to go, well, this is why you need to watch this, and this is why we need to watch that. Which is fine. Educate me. Um, because I do believe when she was summoned, they didn't have that thing where she stood on the, the mound, and then the little reference he made. Because I was reading something on Wikipedia, like, isn't that Rindu the um, the main character of Fate's Day Night, the first one? And then they changed it up in Unlimited Playworks. Um, yeah. Really good though. <laughs> I absolutely love it. The dialogue's so good. The dialogue is absolutely awesome. And um, yeah, I loved it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. What do you guys think of that? What do you guys think of this? Click like, subscribe if you haven't already. Leave comments down below. Let me know what I should watch and discuss in future videos. And I'll see you guys. Yes, you guys. Next time.